Hey, it's Ellen Christina of Embassy Promotions and I help influencers and creators future-proof their wealth from their brand by building digital assets. And in today's video, we're gonna talk about how you can sell digital products alongside your own physical products if you're an influencer or creator who has already started their own physical e-com retail brand, uh, how you can actually be driving more leads and sales whilst using digital products uh, to your physical product business. So you own a re online retail store let's um let's use an example for this scenario so let's use uh like molly may's example so let's say let's say you, you've got your own fake tan brand i know you probably don't but let's just say that so so at the moment obviously you're kind of just driving you're you're you're, you're you're promoting your own physical products and sending sending your buyers, well, your audience straight to your website that has your bottle of fake tan. Uh, fake tan. You know, you're you're sending, you're driving your audience straight to this website. So um, obviously, there's not really there's not an exact funnel here i don't know if you ever kind of heard of like a sales funnel it's kind of like a, a marketing word for basically saying customer journey so obviously a sales funnel is kind of like goes like this and right at the bottom is the sale but right at the top is actually awareness and then as they kind of move through the funnel they go to like problem aware solution aware um you know seller aware or whatever i can't remember what the rest are and then obviously it ends with the sale so when you're sending someone straight from your audience on social media to your website, there's not really, you don't have a way of collecting anyone's details who clicked on the website but didn't buy. You don't really have a way of kind of, of kind of tracking the customer journey there. So what you might want to do is create a digital lead magnet for your physical retail brand so that you can at least track how many leads are signing up for like the, the free, like the digital lead magnet, and then you capture their details and then you can upsell them the, the bottle of fake tan. Do you know what I mean? So then you they're actually going down the funnel and you can see who's in there. You can literally see who's in the sales funnel and you can put more of your time into marketing towards the people who have opted in for the free digital product. So what kind of digital product could you create for free as a lead magnet uh, for a fake time round? Now, obviously, a lot of people will say, OK, new customers get 20 percent off or whatever. Uh, it's OK, but typically when a buyer is signing up to get 20% off 20% off their their product for the, for buying it for the first time there's a buying intent there anyway they were always going to buy it but now they've just got 20% off so it's like if i was interested in buying this at some point in the future but not today I probably wouldn't sign up for that because I would know that it would probably have a time limit on it and I wasn't ready to buy it yet. So I'm not even going to bother putting my thing in. Like, I don't need 20% off today. So that's why I think the discount codes are okay, but they're not the best. Whereas if you created like a physical, um, like a digital guide, maybe it's like a PDF or a checklist or something. I know what you're thinking, like, how the hell would you create something like a digital product for, for like fake time? What the hell? Be creative. Like, think about the problems that people have when they're buying fake tan. Think about the objections that people might have when they're buying fake tan. Think about what a person's problems are before they purchase fake tan and what a person's, what the person's life now looks like after they've purchased fake tan. Um, so this could simply be like a fake tan checklist for like optimum results like all of the things that you need to do before you apply your fake tan for optimum results so that it doesn't look streaky so that it doesn't look orange so that it lasts so that it doesn't go patchy within one day um, so that it doesn't make your skin irritated so that it doesn't make your bed sheets brown so that it doesn't you know all of the thing, all of the things where someone might not want to use this, 
bust them, bust those objections in your digital, in your free digital opt-in first. If you don't want to do a checklist, it could be something like a video. It could be something like um, even just like an email on like, before you buy a fake tan, make sure that you read this. Okay, and it can be like whatever, like don't do this, don't do this, don't do this, don't buy, you know, be careful of the fake tan brands that you're buying that might test on animals. Always look on the back for the leaping bunny, um, for the leaping bunny logo. Um, you know, this is a common ingredient in fake tan that causes your eczema to flare up. You know, it's like stuff that no other brands are doing because people are like, oh, I didn't realize any of that, and they will opt in for these things. Plus. Once they've opted in for your digital opt-in, there's like a really strong buying intent there. Nobody is giving their email address to download these things if they don't have an interest in buying the damn fake down, okay? So it's just something different that you can do that kind of makes your physical retail brand A, stand out from the competition because you're offering like insanely cool like like digital products for people to just like get for free it's like pretty awesome but also it's a way that you can trap people going into your sales funnel so once these people have downloaded that checklist or that guide or whatever or that video on how to apply your fake tan seamlessly gene watts did an amazing youtube video that has like so many views on like how she applies her fake tan. If you literally made a video like that and said, look, we'll send you the video, like just su just give us your email address, we'll send you the video of how to apply the perfect fake tan so it doesn't go orange, it doesn't go streaky, it doesn't go patchy, it doesn't, you know, do whatever. Literally that could be your lead magnet, just a video, okay? Send it to their inbox. So when people have opted in for these things, they go onto your email list and you know obviously where they where they came from because because you'll know what they opted in to get and they're all hot leads they're all hot leads and then whatever email marketing you're using to to send you know like they haven't bought but they're leads i bet you this would work better than just having a pop up on this website that says hey give us your email address and join our mailing list what fucking for i don't need to be on someone else's mailing list i don't need another another weekly newsletter with you selling me stuff like but this this is an ethical bribe they're like okay fine i'll go on your mailing list because i really want this cool thing and then it's like ah oh, hot leads because they have downloaded a piece of digital information that is all about fake tan so they're very 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 likely to want to purchase this all you have to do is just mark it hard to them here with the 20 percent off code for first time buyers or whatever. And it's more likely then that they're gonna move down your sales funnel and you're gonna get the sale, okay? So, and it's not just fake tan that you can do this with, they use it as an example. They use it as an example, you can do it with clothing, you can do it with beauty, you can do it with skincare, you can do it with supplements, you can do it with jewelry, you can do it with like literally anything. It's the most fun part of your offer is coming up with little offers like these and just like see, testing what works and what doesn't. And then when you when you get that hit, you, you hit the nail on the head and you find that thing that your customers or your audience really love downloading and it will be like, and you'll have leads coming out from everywhere. You'll have so many leads, you won't know what to do with them and you're gonna sell so many more physical products. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed uh, this video on um, how to sell digital products alongside your own physical products for influencers and creators. In the next video, we're going to actually look at the dark side of influencers joining MLMs. And there's been like a huge boom since COVID of like random influencers are like suddenly being part of an MLM and you're like, what the hell? Like I didn't really think influencers would be interested in that. We're going to look at kind of the dark side of that and why MLM isn't going to be the best thing for you as an influencer to monetize your audience. And there are better ways than joining an MLM. So I'll see you in the next video.